it didn't seem difficult to me at the time because uh, it kind of things fell in and fell out. Uh, for example, when I was partnered with Danny Thomas, and uh, uh, we were we were doing doing the show, and I said they weren't going to pick it up, and I said, well, excuse me, what happens if we do a couple more after they've canceled it? He said, we have to deficit finance, and I said, why? Why would we want to do that? Why don't we just stop right now? And I said, he said, I'll call them and tell them. I said, I would love to give you that privilege. Call them and tell them we're just not going to do anymore. If the show's canceled, forget it. You know, if they want some more shows, pick the show up. And uh, so that's the way we ended our relationship. And I was going into a movie then, I think it was a Western. And I said, Danny, I know you're going to appear in, at Las Vegas in, in two weeks. And I'm going to go off to, to Europe to shoot a Western in two weeks. So I think we should shake hands and hug and, and say it's been a wonderful ride and just go our separate ways, which is what we did. It ended on a very nice note. Uh, I wish we had stayed in business or could have stayed in business. If, if one of those shows had gotten on the air, uh, we probably would have. And now I'd be living in a 50,000 square foot house in Holmby Hills instead of Aaron Spelling. <laughs>